Good morning, internet. What? Why would you run through the magma? Uh, Alright. Everybody's hurt. Everybody's always hurt. We are back here at the magma planet. I have been turning all of my obsidian into drywall. And now I'm going to work on a, an idea I had for cooling. I don't know precisely how it's going to work, but I realized I should probably start recording and see how we do. So the idea is obviously, you know, steam turbine, aqua tuner, that part's basic. But the idea I was toying with is if I put in a door, let's just say we're going to do that. Not sure if this is exactly where I'm going to put it, but you get the idea. So if I have a door to regulate the temperature inside of here, and then we'll need tiles. What I was thinking is if I build a second steam room to suck the heat out of the magma. Okay, I want this to go down. I don't have enough room up above. Ah, it's just so much magma in the way. So yeah, I think I want to build... No, nope, come on. I want to build some more ladders, and I need to dig this down more to drop the magma down. Yeah. Anyway, let me get a bit more space and then I can start to queue it up. In power-wise, I have... I should probably put... I should have enough glass. Oh, yeah. Let me put on another couple of solar panels. I've got all the rockets tied together and I have the hydrogen generator in here. It's pretty much running it. And then this whole area is designed to uh, reduce the radiation, which is quite nasty. Yeah, let's prioritize that. And obviously you needed to build the exosuit forge because I was starting to run out of suits. They just love swimming in magma. Really? Get out of there, dumb butts. Get out of there. Yeah, bunch of idiots. All right, so now we got some more obsidian we can play with. I don't think I can dig that down far enough. Probably dig this area down. All right, let me keep digging, try and get some more room again. Okay, so idea number one, since I will probably run out of water, I guess we're doing good on water. I have used up all the air though. Oh no, we're still making plenty. We're just backing up the hydrogen. Yeah, so I'm going to put in a couple of steel tiles here once I can get this open. How do you have an unreachable toilet? One, two. One, two. Yep, they all have water. I think it's just confused. <laughs> Everybody's always hurt. But yeah, once I can get this open, then I can put in some steel tiles here and I can suck the heat directly out of this. And this is only 1500 degrees. And then I'll work on the next bit. 
Oh good, they got the obsidian out of there. I can seal this in. I'll probably start disconstructing this ladder. So I can use that obsidian somewhere else. Yeah, see, there they are grabbing it. Now, all the pipes in here, the tiles are quite warm. through magma. Oh, they've done steel. The, yeah, stuff is everywhere. Okay, all that's now hooked up. So let's start pumping in some gas pressure. That will help even out the temperature and we also want some water. So let's do that, that, and that. Over here, that connects to you, that connects to you. And now we're pumping out water. And we'll set you to 200. You're above 200. And we can hook up the power. enough water in there and now we can start the loop and we'll set this to I don't know 25 You up. And now inside of you, just connect you so we aren't dumping water. And did I put enough in the tank? Got yeah, like 100 kilos in there. Yeah, so this will slowly drag the heat out of here. Real reason is there's a uh, no gas. They're not very much. All right, and we want to seal that because we don't want everything out here to get hot. Your overheat temperature is 275, so yeah, if you set it 200. All right, that will slowly drag the heat out of here. Now I can focus on this. Actually, these don't even need to be insulated. They can just be obsidian. Yeah, 
bunch of time passes. I actually realized I do want these to be insulated because I want to turn this into... Oh, don't... My dupes are idiots. My dupes are absolute idiots. You, come up here. You, come up here. Yep, I missed one. Come up here. Yep, Ashcan's about to be incapacitated. Ah, the magma planet. So much fun. R is about to become incapacitated. <laughs> Let's just cancel all that for now. And yeah, let my dupes heal. Maybe if I just go one at a time. Of course you have to stand in the magma. All right, well now I can actually build some more triage cards. Hey, Camille, hop on that. <laughs> Good work, Bert. There's a bed. You guys are actually getting kind of active cooling. Look, it's down to 75C. This is gonna take a while. Well, all be, we have one fully healed dupe. And they like doctoring. It's like, I can't put anyone on this card because, yeah. They're good. How's the radiation out here? Yeah, I might move that bed. Or right, who's in there? Ari, let's get rid of this bed. That way we can put you someplace with less radiation. Come in here. Hey, might as well put the other bed in here as well. Can come in here just because much less radiation. All right, how did someone get entombed or where? Oh no, it's a building entombed. Okay, I thought somebody got entombed back here on the main base. It's very confused. Just shovels doing shovel things. It's dormant, so we should be starting to use up. Haven't been over here to check on this in a bit. That's active. Ooh, we might have to start pumping out more. I'll have to keep an eye on that. We've got uh, just a bit of pressure building up. Here, let's just do this. Let's cut you in half. I'm waiting for this oxygen to go down. I guess it doesn't really matter. I'm sorry for the dupes to heal up, then I can seal the rest of this off and get down into this. And it's just a rinse and repeat kind of thing. Got Bert's in there as well. Everybody gets a bed. Uh, Camille, where are you getting scalded? Where are you? Are you getting scalded inside of the rocket? Uh, okay, well now that I've got this insulated, I can now start turning it into igneous rock. So I want to do temp shift plates made out of obsidian until I get some igneous rock and then I can use igneous rock and the igneous rock will just melt and we'll 
rinse and repeat until we get all the way through. Well, how about you build it from outside of the magma? are idiots. Now I'll get one of my slowest builders on this. Why? I actually do need one more bed. It's not going to be a fast process at all. I mean, temperature plates are 800 kilograms. You see, they get built... They get built at 45 degrees. Get out of there. Do this thing that is also priority setting. There, and hop on it. And then we deconstruct and I just keep repeating until I get the temperature down. And while I was waiting for my dupes to heal, I thought of a better way of doing this. I'm just going to move the slider over, put a pitcher pump in, and just have them pump it over to this side. That'll work better. Ah, oh, the sounds of dupes being scalded. It's a beautiful noise. Oh, we need that ladder segment to go away. And now pitcher pump. Somehow I got my default building to priority seven. It's fine. There we go. Right, now this should go much faster. Magma. Enable auto bottle. Stop it. Unless you're all just going to be doctoring. Which is nice. Usually I only have two dupes over here and I'm always worried about them dying. So, we got plenty of people to pick up the dead bodies. Which so far it's only been that one. What did you do? Drop it? What happened to that bottle? Alright, and now that we actually have a place to put stuff, we can put a mini pot in over here. Yeah, that's much faster. Activate. The temperature in here is coming down to, yeah, almost reasonable. Even the aqua tune is turned off. I'm sometimes an idiot. I'm wondering, like, why is this so hot? Well, I forgot to make these out of insulated tiles. So, yeah, there might be a bit of a uh, steam explosion coming up. Now stuff can actually cool down in here. Who knows what I was thinking. Alright, I think I need to... Oh, I made those... Oops. I made those out of cobalt. They might melt. And we get to move this down. Well, let's see if they melt. What does cobalt melt at? Ooh! Cobalt might not melt. 1494? I've got a little bit of igneous rock up here. And this is actively cooling this. All 
Alright. So let's move all that over to that side. And yeah, let's put that in before we start raining magma back down into the place I'm trying to empty. Alright, now I should be able to come in through here. And kind of tunnel my way sideways. Unless, of course, they just want to hang out in magma. Yeah, a little bit of pressure damage, but that's no problem. That we don't need. That we can disconnect, and we are into the Niobium. And now we can do that. That. Hopefully that one doesn't break. Maybe we can do that one. Uh, in no way was it incredibly difficult. Oh. And then I will put all of my niobium into a container right there. And then it will cool off. Oh, and let's get rid of that. Right. Okay, niobium sounds cool when they dig it. To think, to think. All right, now I should go pick it all up. Sure, we'll point out a plant in here. Temperature's not going to come down fast, but the temperature is going to come down. Well, let's see if we can't grab it all. We got a nice hole. Yeah, let's start to burrow in this way. Usually find going three wide is better. To help my cooling along, I'm going to swap some of these pipes out for Radiant. 
mean, the rest of everything's cooled off. I just want the stuff under the storage bin to transfer a bit more heat. I mean, it's picking up like 10 degrees. I don't come down here. Oh, that's the bottom. Okay. This isn't all super overpressurized. Doesn't look like it. Yeah, so let's just go for it. No, nope, didn't immediately flood the tunnel. We're good. the most hurt. Called by Camille. And then, all right. I'm not very nice to my dupes sometimes. I think once I can get them to dig into this area, this Material is all much colder, and we should be able to solidify the magma. I just got to get it away from this first. Which I'm one tile away from. You know, with the whole army full of hurt dupes. Okay, I'll bite. Where did the sour gas come from? Sour gas came from the other side of the map? I mean, this can't bubble. I'm so confused. Maybe they were carrying some plastic? Must have been. I've, I'm, built, I'm rebuilding this one to take off again, and I'm betting they were carrying the plastic and they dropped it. Okay. Annoying, but whatever. That's gonna make a mess. Do it like that. I mean, they don't have to dig down much more. Yeah, that one. Bonnie there almost got incapacitated, but made it back just in time. All right, let's just dig sideways. All right, Bert, get out of there. Oh, I keep thinking this is below the cooldown point of Igneous Rock, and it isn't. This is still 50 degrees too hot. Okay. This was maybe not a good idea. I think we will call that good. Aside from a sour gas explosion, we've now got active cooling on a little mini base. The oxygen system is mostly keeping up. 
and we got some niobium which was the goal so thank you all very much for watching hopefully you enjoyed all of these scalded dupes the magma base is always well it's fun for me and not fun for the dupes i hope you have a better day than they had <laughs>